Welcome back to another episode of System Shock 2, which is brought to you by uh, me researching monkey brains. Oh, I'm gonna need FM. Uh, it's like Fermium or some shit. Sue me, I don't know what the hell it is. Uh, we're not gonna go back for that at the moment, because I don't really feel the need to. So, we can now finally get into Cargo Bay 2. There's a turret right over here. So, while the... While the, uh, while the security is still up, we'll, we'll go kill it while listening to this. Taking precautions, I proceeded with further experiments. Since we've reached Tau Ceti, creatures have gotten smarter and somehow gained limited psi abilities. I probed another subject with a Beta 5 cycle and sensed many things, but mostly an incredible empathy. The chimps have become acutely aware of their own history of the vivisections and experiments that have been performed on them while on board the Von Braun. They have anger, and they are ready to express it. Clearly, they are both a fascinating scientific resource and an incredible security risk. My recommendation? Either freeze them in cryo-storage for the remainder of the mission, or liquidate them immediately. Who knows what other abilities they'll acquire. So they, unfortunately, they failed to liquidate them. Why, why didn't they listen? Okay, so let's go head up here. Uh, also, you saw a vending machine needed repairs. Um, so that's something you can do with your repair ability. Wow, I killed it. I think I just one-hitted this guy. Poor sap. Alright, so there's some am ammunition up here. Not much else. Ooh, there's a... Uh, I can go up here, though. Put myself up. Uh, there's nothing here anyways. Alright. So security's back up, uh, so I have to be very cautious of that. Luckily, I do have a place I can now go to if I ever want to turn it off. It doesn't matter. Uh, so it doesn't require the fermium yet, so you just leave it be. I'm gonna eat all this. Oh, nothing else really here. All right, I think we're good. Now this is a this is a fucking trap. Okay, that is not an actual physical object you can get. Okay, like watch. I'm gonna just show you because I I hate this thing. Look how my physics didn't work, because you, when you step onto it. Oh shit, look at that. I just noticed that. Okay, now it requires fermium, so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to suspend this one, put this one back on, so that's researching. So we're not wasting any time. It requires nothing but time to research. Uh, well, also the chemicals, but you know. Okay. Uh, huh. wonder if I could be a parkour boss. No, doesn't appear like I can be. Chemical needed. No, maybe I still can. <laughs> Chemical needed. I know chemicals needed. Damn it. Alright, well, um, I think the only option I have is to do this. Fortunately, that doesn't really help the situation. Yeah, it's not going to do a thing. Okay, we'll just consider that a lost, not, lost cause. And let me just suspend it in this one. Get that one going again. It's just bloody nanites. It doesn't matter that much. It makes me a little bit sad on the inside. But now this is a physical object, so now I can pick it up. Uh, I want it. <laughs> All right, fine. We're gonna ignore it for now. All right. Well, there's some people up there. I don't know if there's anything over here. I'm so glad though that. I have options against those uh, bots, though. You know, these guys are going to be the biggest problem because they, they get those hits off, you know. Um, maybe by the end of this, I'm going to get really good at it. I'm just going to, like, fucking negate all the damage. But for the time being, I, I have to kind of just be in melee range. Actually, there's less melee guys later, so it actually does become easier. The, the fact that they exist is actually the problem. You do not hide there's nothing over here. I do hide forever. Oh, here we go. Damn it, give me that. There we go. We'll just uh, boost ourselves onto that ledge and then go back, go up another floor. Oh, oh, you have a gun. Kind of weird how the gun does less damage, huh? All right, well, there's a computer here. So obviously that guy was checking his Facebook before he died. I don't know. I think I do that joke too much. 
I, I, will, I will refrain from doing it now. He was checking his MySpace. Ah, now it's original. No, not really. Alright, well, we're done with this area. And now it's now now I want some more chemicals, so we just put them on hold for the time being. Oh. I'm gonna I'm gonna circle straight this guy. I'm just running around looking for someone else to. Oh shit. Whatever. We'll just uh, walk past him. That's fine by me. Well, we can't get the malfunctioning turrets offline, and now Xerxes isn't even talking to us. Pollard thought of a workaround. By running bypass into central control, we can hack into the turrets locally and take control of them. However, that means walking right up to the little sons of bitches and hoping they don't go off. One thing is sure. I'm going to figure out what the hell happened here. Oh, nothing over here. Oh, there's another one we have here. In some ways, the many is not unlike the UNN. There's a joy in working towards a collective goal, and being able to put aside the things that draw us apart and make us separate. Why do we fear the loss of our individuality so much? Man can dream, but the many can accomplish. I wonder, will this one break just like the last one? Yeah, they keep saying maintenance will arrive shortly. You know what that, usually what that means? That means those giant fucking robots. They're horrible. So if you notice there was that turret there, I'm just, I'm not fighting him. I have no quarrel with him. Uh, it's, I'm right here, so I'm gonna... Oh, that's not good. You know what? Uh, that's a problem. Uh, I do want to kind of go into the area, so I'll try it again. Okay, I'm back here, and I might as well use the pyrokinesis ability I have. Oh, what the hell? What the hell is shooting me? Okay, he's shooting me through the fucking wall. Great. Great hit detection. Uh, Alright, well, I'm thinking I'm just gonna speed through it. Screw it. I don't have to fight these guys. Gotta go fast. That's what I'm gonna use the speed for. For stopping this stupid shit. You might as well have it... You know, as I said, like, most people are like, oh, why would I ever use fucking speed? And I'm just like, well... It can be useful. If you know what you're doing, I suppose. And there's unfortunately a guy upstairs. I'm gonna stealth him. Just watch this fucking... No! There you go. He wasn't prepared. Just uh, get crab. I don't have enough psi. Alright, now he's blown up. Alright, we're good now. It's the best way of dealing with him, unfortunately. It does waste a fair bit of health, which is why I try not to. Here's a laser pistol. It's broken, uh, so if you want to repair it, you can. I'm not doing any sort of uh, sort of thing like that, so. Uh, so that's just me. Alright, uh, what do we have? I can drink some orange juice if I so choose to. And I think I'm good on everything else. Uh, what what was up here that was so important to me anyways? This dead body. Well, you know, we have to explore everything. Ah. Oh wait, there's, there's more dead- oh wait, I already explored this. Okay. I think we're basically done with that. Uh, let's go down the elevator that which we saw before and we'll use speed, get the hell out, and never come back to this area because... Robots, man. Robots just, I hate. 
And now we can... Oh, hey. I'm gonna run away from you, too, if you don't mind. Alright, so let's see where we stand right now. Uh, so, right now, we... Oh, we have two more logs, so let's use these. Constance, I fear now for my life. I think this has gone beyond any imaginings of Diego and Korenchkin. I do not believe they are in control at all. We must discover what it was they found down on the surface of Tau 75, and why they guard the secret so jealously. I think this is more important than my life, or your life, or the life of this ship. Be brave, and be careful. Okay, we got one more. Malone's dead. I was just talking to him, and this cyborg came up behind him and... Okay, Connie, get a grip. Get a grip. I've recoded the door lock and engineering control to 15061. I think I'll be safe in here. Yeah, I'll be safe in here. Alright, so uh, we now have the password, which we wanted to have. Guess it pays to listen to what the game is actually telling you to do. Uh, I was hoping it wouldn't have to use health, but you know. Sometimes you get hit, and sometimes it might get mad. Oh, here we go. So, uh, one of the mechanics I didn't explain is you have surgical unit activation key. Drag it onto this. I can now use it. So, you can get like a free kind of health station wherever you want. Uh, just, you don't get a whole lot of those, but you get enough to basically have like, you know, one in each area kind of a thing. Alright, engineering control. So, the password was... 15061. And we're here. Xerxes is one step ahead of us. He's performed an override on the Fluidix control computer and blocked us out. But keep an eye open. You might be able to find some workaround. He locked us out. with the Xerxes unit. In the interest of keeping secrets from the powers that be, I've installed a backdoor to the Fluidix control computer. To activate it, install hardware override 45M DEX in the system's monitoring unit in command control. You can find 45M DEX in auxiliary storage 5 in the coolant tubes. Key code 34760. Uh, I think the radiation is still a problem here. Guess we'll find out in a second, won't we? Yeah, it is. Do you ever had high So sick. Alright. Uh, we've already been to this one. Okay, I'm going the wrong way. Uh... Oh, actually, no, this is the right way. My bad. My, my deepest apologies, viewer. You must move faster. Your mind cannot conceive of the stakes we are dealing with. Keep your eyes open for utility storage 4. I've laid in some supplies there. The passcode is 59004. Got to get together. Um, the termination of this exchange. We regret any inconvenience. Okay, so I had a bit of redundant software there. So we already went to the other storage that she was talking about. We that was one of the first ones we hacked into, and we got the um, we got the radiation suit from there. That's what she was trying to give us. So three four seven six zero. Three four seven six zero. All right. And now we're in a lab. Nice. So we are going to actually look at what our research. Whoops, what's our research? Okay, osmium. Uh, let's see. Oh, it's the osmium. There we are. And we just use it. Where is it? There we go. Now we have to look for what we're actually here for, which is um, 45M DEX. So, like, this kind of stuff kind of makes it. Mr. Monkey in your office. This kind of stuff, it, it's not, like, as I said, it's a game where, like, there's not, like, like, fucking. It's not holding your hand through it. You have to kind of figure out what to do, and so like I had a pretty good, I had a really good time kind of figuring things out. So it's really fun. 
That's it, we found it. You have not disappointed me. Transmitting cybernetic modules. Let's see, what's this one require? Fermium. Okay. Okay, so let's see, where's Fermium? Do we have Fermium here? No, it's not on this deck, so we'll go to another one later. Oh, uh, we also did pick up uh, a, a log, quote-unquote, but it's actually the, uh, oh, there's an actual log. So you can see there's no fermium here, so we don't have to worry about it. Before, I couldn't get rid of those jar heads from the Rickenbacker, and now I can't find one for love or money. That creepy OSA guy followed me around for two months until he got the hint. Now I tried to contact him to see if he knew what was going on, but all of a sudden, he won't return my mail. Okay. So now we have a control ship override. Radiation hazard. Whatever the hell that means. And we can get behind this guy. It's, it's nice to be able to one-hit these guys. It really is. I'll get better at wrenching, believe me, uh, and get some additional things as well. Okay, so now that we have that chip, uh, you see what I mean about it being not a linear game? I mentioned this before, but you see how I'm backtracking to previous areas, there's more enemies there. It's it's actually, it's really fucking fun. Like, okay. Oh, I don't want the alcohol. Okay, hopefully there's no one in here. Look at this. Back to full health. Oh man, the, the, the guy inside me who wants to save all my resources is, um... Very happy, and you know what? I have 17 points. Is there anything I want to put it into? Nothing for this particularly. Um, eventually, I want to go into that tier because uh, I can get like there's a couple of nice things. Actually, I can. I have to invest into a tier in total, but the, it's a, it's an expensive. It's just look at this. It's like a super expensive investment. It's like 53. Like holy balls. So, I have to be careful of that. So I can get the, this health thing, which is actually kind of nice, but, you know, I, I actually do not feel the need to do that at the moment. Um, I, it's just, I have health hypos. How many do I have? We do not welcome. I don't know why they don't welcome me. It it's kind of makes me sad on the inside. I still have two hypos, so I, I, I can live for now. I'll get more. No worries. You have oh, oh, nope, nothing. So we have this chip, and so we go up the ladder, or all well, the the grab shift. I would always want to. I'd like to ride the grab shift, that, that grab lifts every day shift. And now we go up the sloss elevator. I should probably should actually have my real armor on. I always forget to turn it on. And we put in the chip to override. Good work. I'm uploading some cybernetic modules. Find an upgrade unit as soon as you can and improve your rig. Uh, hacking would be nice, but I'd actually prefer to get some sort of stat points. So I have 27 modules. So I can get an additional endurance point or an additional... I'm going to get endurance because more hit points. And that's that's what I would get that for. So for for a difficulty like impossible, um, you want to last at least like two or three melee hits. By the end of this game, I will have it maxed out and possibly some other buffs. I don't really know. Uh, so I'm just letting you know that. That's what we're gonna be going for. Okay, so we're done here with this area. So we're gonna get the hell out of here. And I have uh, three sci-hypos. See what I mean? Like, the, the game barely gives you enough resources to, to stay alive, although I got a lot of anti-radiation hypos. Which is why, you know, technically the ra radiation suit is not the most useful thing. You can live without it. Okay, so let's get some agility so we're not wasting any bonus time. Oh. Why do I keep picking up your alcohol? What? What? Why is he drinking booze anyways? Alright, so we go over here. Research complete. Oh, our research completed. And let's go see what the report says. So this is uh, this actually happens to be a healing gland. And so I can pick it up off uh, people and so I can use it to heal me. It's nice. So that's that actually counts as a med kit. 
Cool, huh? So let's do the monkey brain. And you need some fermium, so let's give you your fermium, which I didn't actually have, so we'll get later. Now get those engine pods online. You'll have to head to cell one and two and reset the pods manually. After that, reinitialize the system from core control. But that system won't come online until you reset both pods. Keep an eye out. They're mobilizing their real forces. And they know exactly where you are. They're constantly mobilizing. I'm actually gonna go get the Fermium, I think, first. Uh, so let's see where would be the best place of getting it. Oh. Oops. I'm, I'm being too fast, sorry. I gotta go fast. Okay, so let's go to Medsci, and we look at chemical stores. Each deck has uh, a no, chemical that's, that's, storeroom where you can... That's the wrong thing. So we have to look for the one that says, um... Chemical Med... So do they... Yep, they have Fermium there, so let's go. 11, 11 net, uh, cybernetic modules too, so that's, that's kind of nice. That bot is unfortunately always here. But it's always retarded and doesn't see me. Uh, I went the wrong way. Well, not really the wrong way. I went the stealth way, let's just go with that. Yeah, he's mad at me. You, you saw how much it takes for me to take them down, it's just not worth it. I'm not spending a lot of time here. Okay, so now we're using what we need to. Okay, back inside here. And that's, uh... Well, there's a... We got... Oh shit, I just used that health pack by accident, whatever. Okay, we need health anyways. Although, you want to kind of be saving those, those are like full health heals, so... Whatever. Don't misclick, basically, is the game. The name of the game. So, now, radiation, contempt, got, it got rid of it, and that's it. We're here. So, next time we'll see what's up there. I'll see you next time. Bye.